Thank you guys so much for stopping by today. So we're gonna do this gorgeous springtime fairy look. Okay, so to start off, I'm using the Colab, the Fundamental Primer, and this is just their smoothing primer. Next, I'm taking this Colab eyebrow pencil, and this one is the thinner pencil. I believe they have two or three eyebrow products, but I chose this one because I just liked it a lot, and um, I've heard a lot of good reviews about it, so I wanted to try this one out first. Usually, I like to go a lot darker with my brows, but this one worked really good for me. Next, I'm taking their stick concealer here and using that to clean up under my eyebrows and I've tried both of their concealers I tried the no flaws concealer in the um, the wand version and also the stick concealer I like the stick concealer more because it gives you a lot more coverage and I think it just works a lot better for my skin type I do have really oily skin so this one just helps out a lot more And this is what my brows look like once they're done, looking gorgeous, really easy to do. So I'm taking the Colab Matte Foundation as well as those Get Luminous Drops and mixing them together. And then I'm taking my Colab Foundation Brush and blending that out. And I will admit this color is a little too dark for me, but I prefer getting colors that are darker because um, summer is coming up, so I will be getting a lot darker. And um, I could always just add in concealer to make everything match a little bit better, so that's kind of what I did here. I'm taking the stick concealer and highlighting all over my face. I love to do a full coverage look. And then taking my Colab Beauty Sponge. Here's the eyeshadow palette that I will be using. The colors are beautiful. And I'm taking the orange shade that I showed you earlier that's in the palette and using that pretty much all over my eyelid. Next, I'm taking this Palladio blush and using that on the outer corner of my eye. If you're not familiar with how to do cut creases, you can skip this part. You can always just um, go over top of it with some shimmery eyeshadow. It doesn't necessarily have to be a cut crease, but I just wanted to show you guys how it would look. And using the blush again and kind of um, packing on some more color. Next, I'm taking this really pretty beige from the same eyeshadow palette and using that on my eyelid basically in the same area where I um, cut out my crease and then taking this gorgeous shimmery color from collab makeup and this is their um, like glitter pigments and they're so freaking pretty you guys look how gorgeous that looks I feel like I could even use that as a highlighter like all over the face it would be gorgeous and then adding in some of a different color pigment on the inner corner Next, I'm taking this Colab Liquid Eyeliner and using that to line my eyelid. Um, I'm kind of a snob when it comes to pen liners and this one worked really good. It got my wing like perfect and I'm, I'm not mad at it. Next, I'm taking that same Palladio blush that I used on my eyelid and using that basically all over my face. I was going for kind of like a um, really pretty fairy springtime type of type of thing so that's kind of what I went for here and then I basically added the blush all over my face okay next I'm taking that same um, liquid highlighter and using this little brush here to kind of blend that out over top um, where I would want my highlight to go and then going in with the collab highlighter that I'm using here super pretty look how banging that is you guys like the first time I used this, I was like, yo, like, what is this? This highlighter needs to be talked about. I just want to say that first and foremost because it's so good. And then I decided to go back in with some more of the blush and kind of um, add some more blush and then add it more highlighter and then just kind of blended the two together. Next, I'm using this Colab lipstick. Um, it's a really pretty color. I thought it went well with the theme that I had going on here. And after I put the lipstick on, that is pretty much it, you guys. So I am moving, so my background is going to be changing a lot um, over the next couple of days or weeks. 
and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please excuse my background. I promise I'm going to fix it soon and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.